Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. About two weeks ago, I posted a video where Microsoft had announced that the Windows Support Diagnostic Tool had a high severity security vulnerability. Now, just to do a quick recap, um, to launch the tool, if you right click on your start menu in Windows, click on Run and enter MSDT. Click on OK. This will launch the Microsoft Support Diagnostic Tool, which lets you run diagnostics and send the results directly to Microsoft for further analysis um, if you're having issues on your system. Now, the flaw, which is also called Folina, um, was a remote code execution vulnerability found in the diagnostics tool. And um, this meant that an application, as an example like Microsoft Word, could uh, cause the tool to trigger remote code execution potentially with administrator privileges. Now, this Folina um, uh, vulnerability um, in the uh, uh, support uh, Microsoft Support Diagnostic tool um, was affecting virtually all versions of Windows. So that's Windows 7 right through to Windows 11. And um, as many of you know, on the 14th of June, which was yesterday in my region, Microsoft rolled out this month's Patch Tuesday security updates for Windows. And um, according to Microsoft, um, they say that the Folina vulnerability has now been addressed uh, with the latest Patch Tuesday uh, security updates that have rolled out. And if we just head over to the tracking report uh, for that CVE, which is 20223019, uh, regarding that remote code execution vulnerability, um, this was released on the 30th of May last month and was last updated on the 14th of June. So that was uh, the same day the Patch Tuesday security updates rolled out. And Microsoft has mentioned uh, in this tracking report that the update for this vulnerability is in the June 2022 cumulative Windows updates. And they also go on to say that they recommend that their customers install the updates to be fully protected from the vulnerability. So for Lina... Uh, the uh, remote code execution vulnerability uh, um, which was caused and affecting the Microsoft Windows support diagnostic tool has now been addressed with the latest patch Tuesday updates that rolled out on the 14th of June 2022. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.